Kim is dealing with so much lately due to the fact that people are saying her children prefer hanging out with Bianca. I am just in protection mode of my kids. She recently took Kim's kids on a trip to South Korea, which left Kim feeling very insecure, according to a source. Looking at this realistically, Kim was probably glad she got a break, but sources feel that Bianca's close bond with her children leaves her a bit worried. I just have my kids. My husband moves from state to state. North has particularly started idolizing Bianca and even dressing in ways that are similar to her. Two months after Kim and Kanye divorced, he got married to Bianca, who has been by his side 24 seven ever since. When she was spotted in the airport, she was spotted wearing a tight cream colored and long sleeves top with matching shorts, a matching paperboy cap and heels, which was very different than her normal attire. And seeing how much Kanye's kids love Bianca, they've decided to try themselves for a little one, according to a source. Kanye expressed his desire to expand their family, even hinting at it during a Las Vegas album listening party in December 2023, when he rapped on the track Timbo Freestyle, stating that, another baby is my end goal. It's no secret Kim and Ye have tried to see eye to eye in the past since finalizing their divorce in November 2022. Since their split, Kim has made it a priority for their kids to have a relationship with their father, despite describing the situation as really effing hard. She went on to say, I could be going through something, but if we're riding to school and they want to listen to their dad's music, no matter what we're going through, no matter what is happening in the world, I have to have that smile on my face and blast his music and sing along with my kids and act like nothing's wrong. As soon as I drop them off, I can have a good cry. But it affects it's my not, kids. Of course it does. Kanye married Bianca in a small ceremony in December 2022, and Kim and Bianca have been spotted attending the same event on numerous occasions. Bianca and Kim attended a listening party for Ye's album Vultures 2 in San Francisco. They were spotted in the VIP section and were seen amicably chatting in a video shared by DJ Ferris. Kim and Ye's four children were also in attendance, with North even taking the stage with her father during the event. Bianca has bonded with her husband's four children, spending Easter Sunday with them in a celebrity hotspot, no boo for dinner and then heading to a theater for movie night. While Bianca is known for her strange fashion, she toned it down for the family night. I know the clothes Ye makes Bianca wear does trouble Kim, mostly because of the kids, a separate source told In Touch on April 9th, 2024. The kids think Bianca is cool, but some of her outfits are eyebrow razors. They giggle about some of the things she wears, but they do like her. When Bianca Sensori does something, we can guarantee that Kim Kardashian will follow shortly after. When Bianca was wearing fur, Kim hopped on that trend shortly after. Her edgy outfits, Kim did that too. Bianca dyed her hair red, what do you think Kim is doing? This is all according to fans and people are noticing way too many similarities that they consider quite creepy. Listen, I love my life. I love everything that comes along with it. I am not complaining. Kim Kardashian stunned us recently with some gorgeous red hair locks that looked fabulous on her. She shared a selfie looking confident and in love with her new hair. The catch? Fans are calling her out for copying Bianca who went red just a few months before this. Not really, it's no. all about me. <laughs> <laughs> They're saying that Kim is desperate to become exactly like Bianca. We asked award-winning film actor Lucas York what he thought about this. He also works with many brands as a model. He weighed in on his thoughts saying, Kim looks great, sporting every outfit I see her in. Although, is Bianca's style a trend that's being copy and pasted? The most notable characteristics of her outfits was her red hair. Love is literally the whole point, she said. This is something I can agree with along with many others. I can appreciate the boldness of her style even if it's reminiscent of another. Taking note that she's always displaying strong confidence in everything she wears and rightfully so. Something we can all aspire for when we try the fashion that resonates with us. Do things have to be original all the time? If it resonates, then let it shine. The only question that remains is, could it be more interesting? Wow, interesting take. If you guys want to stay tuned on Lucas' upcoming projects, it's best to follow him on Instagram. Fans of Kim had questions about her recent look and decided to comment on her post. Stay away from the sensory style, one person commented, while someone else wrote, Kim, why? You don't have to copy anyone else. Another online user referred to her as Kim Sensori. As reported by OK Magazine, Kim feels a lot of compassion for Bianca, and the pair have been amicable in past encounters. An insider shared what Kim apparently thinks of the marriage. 
She knows firsthand how controlling Kanye is, how difficult it is to get away from him once he has you hooked. And the source said, adding that she can only imagine how the poor girl was lured in by the limelight and the lifestyle that Kanye can offer. But then that is sad to me. If Kim is copying, what could be the reason? According to public relations specialist Ryan McCormick, Kim's outfit may have been chosen on purpose to attract attention or make a statement to her ex-husband Kanye West. It's been so many instances at this point, it's unreal. Despite the fashion similarities, a source revealed that Kim has advised Kanye West to make sure Bianca avoids wearing revealing outfits around their children. Kim reportedly expressed surprise that Bianca would dress in such a manner around the kids. Bianca has since adjusted her style, wearing more covered up clothing when in the presence of Kim's children, in contrast to the other outfits she enjoys wearing. Bianca is back and for different reasons this time. Looks like her sisters are turning into the Kardashians more and more. Let's see how Bianca Sensori and her sisters are the new Kardashians. Her clothing, or lack thereof, has received a lot of attention, mostly negative. Of course, Sensori may be doing it entirely for the attention. Nick Eid believes that the attention that Bianca, Angelina, and Alicia, those are her two sisters, have received could eventually lead to greater and better things. They may not have anywhere near the reach on social media that the Kardashians do, but with their looks and style and Kanye by their side, they are beginning to get noticed, Eid told the US Sun. The brand and culture expert continued, I can see them being snapped up for a reality show and following on their adventures becoming more and more famous. Time will tell if they can match the Kardashians, but I think they could become part of pop culture very soon. But not everyone thinks the Sensori sisters have such great futures. As public relations expert Lauren Beeching made apparent in an exclusive interview with the US Sun, I'm sure the Sensori sisters Bianca, Angelina, and Alicia will continue to make waves with their bold fashion and close-knit family vibe, which has naturally drawn comparisons to the Kardashians. However, when you look at their Instagram followings and overall influence, there's still a significant gap. The management expert continued. She said, the Kardashians Kardashians, especially Kim, have spent over a decade building an empire with millions of loyal fans and successful brands like Skims that have left a major mark on the fashion industry. Additionally, while Bianca's connection to Kanye West certainly brings attention, his mixed reputation can be both an asset and a challenge in terms of public perception. Bianca has two sisters, Angelina, a model who also works with Bianca, and Alicia, a nurse who lives and works in Brisbane with her kid. Prior to beginning employment at Kanye West's apparel company Yeezy in Los Angeles in November 2020, Bianca was a resident of Australia. The well-known Australian trio has been likened to the Kardashians. They grew up in a wealthy Melbourne neighborhood. Kim Kardashian, who wed Bianca's husband Kanye from 2014 until 2022, is the most evident link though. The youngest of Bianca's siblings is Angelina. She resides in Australia and frequently updates her Instagram feed with photos from her travels and affluent lifestyle. Even though she doesn't have the same popularity or fan base as her well-known older sister, Angelina has more than 11,000 followers as of August 2024. Conversely, Alicia has maintained a more modest presence. Although her Instagram bio indicates she is a nurse and has a son, her page is private. Bianca's celebrity status has gone from non-existent to global when she married rapper Kanye West. The two of them are frequently pictured traveling the world together. She has gained notoriety for social media posts, for how she dresses in public. Her interesting, occasionally abstract outfits and the criticism she's faced for donning them have made headlines around the country. Bianca's sisters have also recently started to garner media notice by copying their siblings' striking appearance. Brand and culture analyst Nick Eid exclusively told the US Sun, Bianca Sensori and her two sisters, Angelina and Alicia, are beginning to shape themselves as the new Kardashians, with risky looks and clothes. He said, they are hitting the headlines just like the world's most famous family have done for many years. With all eyes on Bianca who's causing a stir in her clothing choices when out and about, they are playing the PR game and winning when it comes to column inches. Bianca seems to be living up to the PR cliche that any press is good good press, since she seems to take flack for her attire. The architectural designer recently went out with her spouse to see a quiet place day one in Los Angeles while sporting a little silver top and shorts the color of beige. Some labeled her lack of day wear disgusting, while another said that she should have been denied entry on X, the official Twitter account. A few days later, Bianca did some errands in Los Angeles and went out in a top. 
Nima Romani, the president and co-founder of West Coast Trial Lawyers, told the US Sun that being a show-off is a misdemeanor in California that carries a maximum six-month jail sentence. Bianca has not been charged or placed under arrest for being a show-off. Romani continued, if there is a prior conviction, it can be prosecuted as a felony. Both misdemeanor and felony convictions require the individual to register as an offender for 10 years. But in California, showing your goods is generally not showing off. This is to protect women who are feeding or showing themselves for non-offending reasons. The attorney continued, the same applies to showing off one's pants, like Sensori has been doing. Given these protections, it's unlikely that Sensori will be arrested or prosecuted. Of course, there are non-legal ramifications of Sensori's conduct, though. Ye appeared to have gained the endorsement of Bianca's Australian family. Although Bianca and Kanye's marriage is incredibly happy news for my sister and my family, but we choose to have some privacy for the time being, Angelina told the Herald Sun. Despite being the most reserved of the sisters, Alicia expressed her happiness for Bianca and Ye's marriage by remarking that she was super happy for them both. Kanye, what's the best part about being a dad? The kids. Kanye has said some things about Bianca and his desire to have children, but fans are calling it quite creepy. Kanye West and his wife Bianca Sensori may be ready to welcome a child together, but insiders claim that Kanye West's mindset on it all is bone chilling. We get too caught up in the past and what everyone's saying and what everyone's tweeting. An insider recently told In Touch Weekly that Ye wants to create the perfect person. Now, listen, we all want our kids to be the best versions of themselves, but people are seeing this as slightly out of hand. Not only is he allegedly trying to make the perfect human being, but he reportedly chose Bianca because her DNA will be the perfect blend with his. I showed people that I understand how to make perfect. It sounds like the plot to a sci-fi film. An insider weighed in and said one of the main reasons he picked Bianca is because he's convinced that her DNA will be a perfect blend with his to make the most genetically blessed offspring. He's always been into achieving the perfect human specimen, so he's very excited to have Bianca consulting with doctors to figure out the best option. They added, he feels like he owes the world more of his genius and now that Bianca has proven herself as a viable baby mama, he's ready to do whatever it takes to get her pregnant. Tirelessly, countlessly remind people of your vision. He's also talking about how he's planning multiple routes. So um, yeah, it's a bit creepy, especially if what these insiders are saying is 100% accurate. Like I said, it sounds like a sci-fi horror plot. For those who don't know, Bianca and Kanye started dating in November 2022 and allegedly tied the knot two months later. TMZ was first to report the embattled rapper has sort of tied the knot with Bianca Sensory. The reason the legality behind this union is up in the air is that while they did have a secret ceremony, no marriage certificate or license has been found according to the New York Post. Mark Brombacher, who is an award-winning actor and writer, had a funny way in on the subject. Well, I'm happy to hear that Kanye and Bianca are having a baby, but uh, Bianca Sensori, wasn't the last time she was out in public she was wearing nothing but a Ziploc bag? Kanye and his ex-wife Kim Kardashian share four children together that Bianca is a stepmother of. Insiders previously told In Touch Weekly earlier this year that Kanye and Kardashian's four children actually don't mind Bianca's outfits at all, and they're pals with her. The kids think Bianca's cool, but some of their outfits are eyebrow razors, they said. They giggle about some of the things she wears, but they do like her. According to the US Sun, Bianca has no plans to dress more modestly when she does become pregnant and will carry on with her usual style. A source said Bianca is in her element. She loves the attention and being dressed by Ye, despite what everyone thinks of her outfits. She feels a lot of her looks are artistic, not just about the fashion. Bianca is fully dedicated in it and for the long haul. She doesn't care what people think of her. Lately, we've been seeing Bianca embracing more natural makeup looks that show off her pretty face and fans have been enjoying it. It looks like Kim's kids are now taking fashion inspiration from their stepmom Bianca. Oh no, could this be bad? Let's dive in. Kim's daughter North has grown very close to Kanye's wife Bianca. On August 14th, 2024, Kim and North had an outing together where North dressed very closely to Bianca. Many fans are worried because Bianca has a significant influence on North. Given Bianca's typical style, it might not be ideal for her to be shaping a young child's fashion choices. Hi, I'm Kim Kardashian West. 
Kim has already warned Kanye not to let Bianca dress in her normal attire in front of their kids, especially after North came out with a drawing of Bianca showing her full backside. On their outing, North wore a brown fur hat over long braids, looking very similar to the hats that Bianca wears regularly. North teamed her eye-catching headgear with a button-up blue shirt, gray and blue argyle sweater vest, and baggy camouflage shorts. Meanwhile, Kim was dressed in a mustard yellow Miu Miu top and coordinating suede pants. North, who has three younger siblings, rounded out her look with white tube socks and beige and dark blue sneakers. And she flaunted a pristine, square-shaped French manicure. She and her mother took turns holding a small fluffy brown pup in their arms as they exited the Ritz Carlton Hotel. They got a ton of backlash for the pup with a ton of commenters saying they use the dog as a fashion accessory. Let me read you guys some of the comments. One said, I feel sorry for the poor dog, just a fashion accessory for Kim's yellow clothes. Another said, leave the dog at home with the nannies. Poor little pooch is not a toy. A third said, that dog is the most adorable thing, such a cutie, I feel sorry for it though, being the new accessory to grab people's attention. Okay guys, you've gotta admit though, the doggy looks pretty content to be in the arms of its rich and famous owners, and I'm sure it's well taken care of. Shortly after she appeared as young Simba in the Lion King's 30th anniversary concert at the Hollywood Bowl, she wore a yellow fur hat. In an Instagram post from Kim, her daughter teamed it with the other mustard tone pieces from the brand. North looked effortlessly cool as she toted a fuzzy crossbody bag and a baggy pale yellow sweatsuit. And Kim drew comparisons to Bianca this past January as she also got in on the fluffy hat trend. In addition to North, exes Kim and Kanye share Saint, Chicago, and Psalm. Kim filed for divorce in February 2021 after nearly seven years of marriage. Bianca tied the knot with Kanye in December 2022, and these days the two are rarely seen apart. She often raises eyebrows with her outfit choices, and even more now that North is taking inspiration and wearing a hat so similar to her. According to a source, North adores Bianca and thinks she is the coolest person walking. <laughs> And usually when a young person idolizes, they will try hard to emulate everything the person does. So let's really hope that North does not see what Bianca is wearing day to day. Bianca Sensori is stepmom of the year, spending tons of quality time with Kanye and Kim's children, and they seem to love her. They went for dinner together, and instead of wearing her normal attire, she chose to dress in a more demure fashion. Beautiful. I missed you, yeah. A parking lot employee held the door open for Bianca as she emerged from the unmissable metallic vehicle before gathering her friends. Bianca's husband, Kanye West, did not appear to be present. They've been married for nearly two years now. Kanye was previously married to Kim Kardashian. They share four children together, Saint, Chicago, North, and Psalm. Did you tell Saint? No. Dad picked you up in a fire truck? Look at the lights. Look at the lights on the outside. Are they recording on the outside to see the Bianca recently was seen supporting her husband following the release of his latest album, Vultures 2. Bianca was joined by her sisters, Angelina and Alicia, at a listening party for the album in Salt Lake City. Bianca has generated countless headlines for the types of outfits she wears, but her latest look was quite a turnaround from her usual looks. At least she tries to present herself clothed around the kids, I guess. A source previously told DailyMail.com that Kim had warned Kanye not to let Bianca wear her usual looks in front of their children. Kim instructed Kanye to never let Bianca dress like that around their kids, an insider revealed exclusively to the DailyMail.com. She is truly surprised that Kanye would let his wife leave the house like that. Unlike in his marriage with Bianca, Kanye used to frequently ask him to change her outfits if he didn't like them, with Kanye heavily influencing her fashion choices during their six year marriage. Kanye did the same thing he's doing with Bianca to Kim throughout their marriage. Daily Mail's source explained. The difference is that when Kanye dressed Kim, he was respected as a person, as an artist. Unfortunately, Kim knows what Bianca's going through, but she feels Bianca should have known what she was getting into. A different source previously revealed to DailyMail.com that Bianca's parents were a bit iffy by her outfits and think she was being controlled by Kanye. Bianca and Kanye tied the knot in December 2022, less than one month after his divorce was finalized with Kim. They've gallivanted all over the world together to attend A-list fashion events as well as to promote Kanye's new music. Kim and Bianca, however, are on good terms, with Kim even preserving great compassion for Bianca, according to OK Magazine. An insider said she knows firsthand how controlling Kanye is and how difficult it is to get away from him once he has you hooked. Furthermore, Kim apparently believes that Bianca Sensori, who worked as a design architect at Yeezy, was influenced by the rapper's flashy lifestyle. The source also said, that poor girl was lured in by the limelight and the lavish lifestyle Ye can afford. Another rumor about Kanye and Bianca's marriage is that he could potentially be purposely separating her from everyone else. 
Kanye has apparently banned Bianca from using social media for her protection and limited communication with her friends and family, even though they've been trying to reconnect with their dear friend to try to express concerns, an insider conveyed that she rejected her friend's advances. Bianca Sensori is on stepmom duty. Recently, Kanye's girl Bianca Sensori has been caught bonding more than once with Kim Kardashian's daughter, and we can't help but wonder how Kim feels about that. The whole situation is sad, and I don't know how to manage it. Not to mention, most stepmoms don't take their kids to see a movie in their underwear like Bianca did. Bianca turned heads while taking her stepdaughter North 11 to see Deadpool and Wolverine with her husband Kanye West in LA on Saturday. And I'm not sure what I noticed first, the fact that Bianca was super close with North, hugging her, or the fact that she forgot to wear her pants. I mean, Bianca's lack of clothing isn't surprising, but you'd think she She'd cover up more around the kids. While chaperoning North to the R-rated superhero movie starring Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman, the 29-year-old wore a revealing outfit that turned heads. Shockingly, the Australian model was still seen putting her curves on display in nude boy shorts and a long-sleeved shirt. For the casual outing, Bianca wore a white long-sleeved top, nude underwear, and black strappy heels. She accessorized her pantless look with a beige baseball cap over. Kanye, as usual, wore a black hoodie pulled over his head, sunglasses, and matching sweats. North, Kanye's daughter with ex-wife Kim Kardashian dressed normally on the other hand and seemed super friendly with her stepmom, sharing a big hug outside the theater. Since North is well under 17, she needed to be accompanied by a parent or legal guardian to see the film, which is Marvel's first R-rated movie. Kanye's wife was seen holding her stepdaughter Northwest close as the three of them stepped out to watch Deadpool and Wolverine. Afterwards, the three returned to Kanye's Cybertruck. On the way home, the father of four pulled over over to check out a piece of land in Beverly Hills while Bianca stayed in the car. In the past, it's been reported that Kim has asked Kanye to tell Bianca to cover up and stop wearing her infamously scandalous outfits around their four kids. You feel like you're the worst mom if something's going on and you can't fix it. Bianca has been seen in tons of headline grabbing outfits since marrying Kanye in December 2022, less than a month after his divorce from Kim was finalized. Most of these outfits are completely see through or look like undergarments. On an opposite note from Bianca, Kanye would always ask Kim to change her outfits if he felt she was showing too much skin during their seven year marriage. In either case, he's still having a say in the way that his wives dress. Kim has openly discussed Kanye's influence over her fashion choices throughout their relationship. In a 28 interview, she said, I always thought I had really good style until I met my husband and he told me that I had the worst style. In an episode of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, she said, Kanye has always dressed me. In the early 2000s, he would literally just send me random emails with all these looks and what my style should be. However, Kanye's apparent control over Bianca's style has raised concerns among her friends, who feel she's changed since meeting him and is being used for publicity. Her parents are reportedly mortified by seeing their daughter in such revealing clothes, like a clear raincoat with nothing underneath but a pair of boots. And yes, she did wear that. A source said, Bianca clearly doesn't realize that what she wore isn't only disgusting and setting a bad example, but she's also potentially breaking the law. Honestly, I would never be able to go out in public like that, and I think most of us can say the same. While North is still bonding with her stepmom, regardless of what she's wearing. Aside from their family movie date earlier this month, the two were seen spending quality time together grabbing groceries in Japan. A few days before, they also spent some one-on-one -on -one time cuddling with pigs at the My Pig Cafe in Tokyo. Eyewitnesses said Bianca and North shared laughs and appeared to have a close relationship. In the past, the pair also have enjoyed fast food runs and dined at celebrity hotspot Nobu together. Ah, uh, Bianca Sensori and Kanye West. Could you name a more attention-grabbing duo? I certainly can't, so let's look at their most attention-grabbing moments. Bianca Sensori modeling new Yeezy outfits. Bianca Sensori formally joined Ye's side in May 2023 after becoming his new wife. To everyone's surprise and amazement, the Australian architect was seen advertising a strange new Yeezy outfit on Instagram. Body tape and black high heels were the only accessories used in the risque photo shoot, which was shared on Moalola Ogunlesi's Instagram page. 
Hogan Lessie was a former employee of Yeezy. There was little room for interpretation after the outburst, and Ye quickly faced blowback. He received a lot of criticism for his views. Julia Fox, Ye's ex-girlfriend, expressed her support for Ye by leaving hard eye emojis beneath the pictures, proving that she wasn't hateful. The happy couple indulged in PDA during a lunch date. In the summer of 2023, Ye and his new partners started to make more public appearances following months of rumors that they got hitched. Ye, who was once known as Kanye West and Bianca, were frequently photographed out and about in Los Angeles in June of that year. The couple was once caught on camera sharing intimate moments together in front of the Lobster Restaurant. And then old modeling photos of Bianca Sensori leaked online. Pictures from Bianca Sensori's modeling days made their way online in August of 2023. Their candidness struck a chord with a lot of fans. In one picture, Sensori is seen promoting the swimsuit line Sasha Label while sporting a bikini. Ah, uh, who could forget Ye and Bianca Sensori exploring Italy? In August of 2023, Ye and Bianca made their now famous trip to Italy. Bianca's attire selections during the month-long project drew a lot of criticism in the conservative Catholic nation. Ye made the spontaneous decision to take a picture with his new bride while out shopping in Florence's Via dei Calzaioli on one memorable day. The couple was surrounded by crowds of onlookers causing the entire retail center to stop for a time. Ye and Bianca took an interesting boat ride while in Italy too. The couple's enjoyment of a riverboat cruise through Venice was by far the most obscene moment of their trip to Italy. The two attracted spectators who started to film them, which is what revealed that Ye was showing his derriere. Bianca can be seen in more pictures and videos with her head resting on Ye's lap before his pants are down. Worse, whatever happened aboard the boat was sufficient to get you banned for life. In September 2023, Venezia Turismo Motoscafi, the Venice water taxi operator, declared in a statement that the pair were no longer permitted to board any of their vessels. Ye and Bianca attended Art Basel. In preparation for Art Basel in Miami on December 17, 2023, Ye and Bianca returned from Saudi Arabia where Ye was recording his as-yet-unreleased album, Vultures. Bianca was observed during the expedition sporting a sheer jumpsuit that was completely transparent. Ye posted photos of Bianca to Instagram. Ye revived Instagram in December 2023 and uploaded a ton of pictures to his page, continuing to highlight his wife's attractive attributes into the new year. The aforementioned pictures were uploaded without any prompting on January 1st of 2024. They were also very illuminating. No pants this year, Ye captioned one picture. Bianca Sensori celebrating her 29th birthday. On January 6th, Ye called in Bianca's 29th birthday. He began by posting a close-up of his wife's face, followed by a heartfelt remark and a few more sultry pictures of his sweetheart. Happy birthday to the most beautiful, super bad, iconic muse, inspirational, talented artist, master's degree in architecture, 140 IQ loving by my side every day when half the world turned their backs on me, and the most amazing stepmom to our children. I love you so much, thank you for sharing your life with me, Ye wrote. He then added in a separate post, y'all know who ran the summer, she went to a club to celebrate her birthday, in part. Ye shopped with Bianca wearing a tiny bikini in Las Vegas. On January 6th, Ye and Bianca were seen shopping in Las Vegas, and onlookers were shocked by what they saw. The pair were perusing the Balenciaga boutique at the Wynn Hotel in Las Vegas. According to the footage, Bianca was barely able to cover herself in the little bikini top she was wearing. She was also observed going about the hotel in her pants. Bianca Sensori looks interesting while wearing a raincoat. Ye and Bianca Sensori began their relationship in February 2024, adhering to their cutting-edge style preferences. This time, Bianca wore a see-through raincoat and appeared to be wearing very little below. February 5th seemed to have grabbed the moment. Ye was wrapped with a long brown poncho, boots, gloves, and a black mask. I told y'all about them so shocked they be corny. Bianca Sensori wore a certain outfit to Milan Fashion Week. Bianca made an impression on the first day of Milan Fashion Week in February 2024 by wearing an extremely exposing gown. Ye's wife had on what appeared to be a belt wrapped around her waist and pinned over her shoulders made of black leather. After that, the leather was cut into a V-shape close to Bianca's bits, fitting somewhat loosely. Bianca.
Bianca Sensori wore stockings, just stockings, to a Paris Fashion Week event. In February 2024, Ye's wife attracted attention on several occasions during Paris Fashion Week. In pictures taken of the couple at the beginning of the week, Bianca was seen with a fluffy brown fur coat on, but she was only wearing sheer stockings as an alternative to pants, so there wasn't much room for speculation. Bianca Sensori also showed off in a certain top. Then, in February 2024, while Ye and Bianca were in town for Paris Fashion Week, they were seen exploring the city. Bianca was caught on camera sporting an entirely sheer ensemble during their stroll, which included an invisible tank top revealing her pec muscles and stockings that let anyone who happened to glance by observe her intimate bits. Bianca Sensori then flaunted her assets in a bodysuit. With her bodysuit exposing her derriere, Bianca Sensori flaunted her endowments and left very little to the imagination. On March 8th, 2024, Ye's wife went with her husband to a listening party for his upcoming Vultures 2 album in Los Angeles, dressed interestingly. Black garments in the garter style, which showed off her derriere cuts, went well with the bodysuit. Black kidney heel pumps finished Bianca's sultry ensemble. Bianca Sensori wore an eye-popping miniskirt. Ye and Bianca were spotted strolling through Los Angeles on March 20th, 2024, when Bianca was once more seen sporting an extremely out there outfit. When seen from the back, Bianca's silver bikini top and eerily short matching mini skirt leave little room for interpretation. At the very least, Bianca's wearing pants in front facing pictures. Bianca also wore lace tights and an undertop. Bianca was seen out and about with Ye in April of 2024 with only an undertop and lace tights. The pair was seen heading out of Los Angeles' Gigi's, a French restaurant. Bianca also wore an interesting bodysuit another time. In June 2024, Ye and Bianca went on a European tour. Bianca was seen wearing a bodysuit to a production meeting in Prato, Italy during the trip. In one picture, she's seen getting out of a car with a sketch pad that has drawings on it. Bianca's behind and her massive side peck are both fully visible due to the one-piece attire. Kim Kardashian has been accused of mimicking the style of Bianca Sensori, the wife of Kanye West, her ex-husband. I don't want to say I connect with everything about her. Fans have previously drawn attention to the two celebrities' striking similarities. Kim was previously seen visiting a friend in Montecito. California when she wore a plunging light blue dress and went fully no under from the waist up. People that are around that might not know this get really surprised. The Kardashians actress was spotted flaunting her newly colored blonde hair as she got into her opulent Tesla Cybertruck. Kim accessorized her slender dress with shoes and tights that matched. Fans of the Kardashian-Jenner family weren't afraid to voice their opinions in the Reddit community where the new Kim images were posted. The original billboard stated it's obvious that when Kim gets dressed, she has Kanye on speed dial. It's all so tired and cringe, remarked a second critic. Others drew attention to Kim and 29-year-old Bianca's similar fashion sense. We have to maintain boundaries. She purposefully sees what brands Ye and Bianca are into and then intentionally copies months later. Another person responded. A fourth individual commented, there she goes again with another Bianca look of wearing the light-colored heels that match the hose. I wonder if she thinks everyone is stupid and we don't see the blatant mimicking. It's legitimately embarrassing. This anything you can do, I can do better one-sided battle she's having with Bianca, said a fifth Kardashian critic. Ugh, it's exhausting being better than everyone else. Fans are starting to notice more and more signs that Kim is morphing into her ex-husband's wife as she keeps getting caught by photographers and posting pictures of herself on social media platforms. The co-founder of Skins was recently seen in photos sporting a shimmering black outfit that included heels and skin-tight tights. Bianca is renowned for her skin tight, almost undetectable costume. Back view is cosplaying Bianca, so obvious and desperate, one fan said. Kim had posted some fresh pictures of herself the day before, all dressed in Balenciaga, which Bianca wears a lot. The majority of the time, that's all I want to do. Fans noticed that Kim styled her hair similar to Bianca, even though she added a pop of pink to it in the photos. One admirer asked, whoa, who is she morphing into now? Someone else retorted, Bianca, you're honest right. Kimberly really needs a psych eval. I'm not even kidding. This behavior is pathological and dangerous, the third person to criticize the beauty mogul said. She is a straight up mimic fraud. Unbelievably many people think Kim is going too far in her attempts to compete with Bianca 
and win back Kanye. Not just by copying, but by becoming obsessive about it. However, it seems that Bianca and Kim get along well. Bianca is excellent with their children and Kim admires this. They have even been spotted together on outings. However, is Kim attempting to reestablish a relationship with Bianca with the intention of doing so with Kanye? That's the belief held by some. Although it's absurd to accuse someone of that, women have been known to try to get close to their husbands by befriending other women. Kanye had previously advised Kim to pretend to be the mother of his kids. He said he didn't like the way she dressed, calling on her to be more modest. That has, however, been the complete reverse since he started dating Bianca. And while some believe that Bianca was the one who came up with the idea for the entire affair and that Kanye was only supporting her, others have accused Kanye of manipulating Bianca and making her wear this way for months. Well, we got a brand new headline here on Kim Kardashian, and it has everything to do with Bianca Sensory. Did Kim Kardashian leave a terrifying message for Bianca Sensory? Kim Kardashian is absolutely done with Kanye West's new wife, Bianca Sensory, and is not interested in ever speaking to her. She says that she can see Bianca being molded into Kanye's ideal of the perfect woman. Contrary to a report that claimed that Kim actually wanted to talk some sense into Bianca, well, one source said that Kim has completely moved on from Kanye West and his relationship. The source went on to say this specifically, she absolutely does not want to talk to her. Kim is actually a firm believer in letting people be on their own journey and figure out life. She would never call someone and warn them. As much as Kim may have her opinions about Bianca and really not like the fact that she got so close so quickly to her children. Kanye West celebrated his 46th birthday in Los Angeles. North sported full black attire while holding hands with stepmom Bianca. Who she shares with Kanye West. I don't think that she would ever come out publicly and drag Bianca or make statements like, oh, are you sure that you can handle Kanye West? Like. I was married to him once, so I know what it's like, or you know, anything like that. I, I don't think Kim would do that. I think I made the wrong decision. <laughs> I also think that all those conversations would happen in private with her closest people, like her sisters, and she would make sure that it's off camera. So like it's off the record, nobody can leak this. Might get misinterpreted and people don't see the context behind it. And also Kim is smart when it comes to protecting the public image of herself and her family. And she's very calculated in what she says publicly and who she says it to. And I think that this is just one of those moments where Kim is being very smart with her words and biting her tongue. You know, she's really holding back what she actually wants to say publicly about Bianca. Now the source also added that what Kim is most focused on is the matter of co-parenting at the same time the well-being of her children, North, Saint, Chicago, and Sam, who she shares with Kanye West. Kim Kardashian and Kanye West are the parents of North 9, Saint 7, Chicago 5, and Psalms 3. The source also dismissed any gossip that Kim Kardashian is deeply embarrassed by Kanye West's affectionate relationship with Bianca. Like Kanye West and Bianca's love story has been fast paced since they got together in early 2023. However, it seems that recently their relationship has become more intimate, at least in the public eye. Photos showed them engage in certain acts and behaviors on a private water taxi in Venice in late August 2023. Sources revealed that Kim is watching the situation with Kanye and Bianca open mouth. Like in the pictures, Kanye West's pants were pulled down and he exposed his backside. While Bianca was also seen wearing very revealing outfits publicly in Italy and also in Japan. With Kanye and Bianca's relationship seemingly going so well, they work together and reports say that they are perfect for each other based on sources close to them. Like, I wanna know, like, do you guys actually believe Kim is okay with all of this? Is she really not interested in speaking with Bianca? You okay? Mm, not okay. Like although Kim and Bianca are definitely in two different phases of their lives, they have different responsibilities and have different experiences with Kanye West. Right, I get that. I feel like Kim though still feels a type of way about this whole relationship. Because that's who I loved and that's who I remember. I'll do anything to get that person. Because whether you like it or not, your ex's partner 
will be involved in your life in some way, shape or form because you share children with them. So even though the source says that Kim's focus is on her children and co-parenting, she just can't avoid Bianca forever. Like there will be some overlap for sure. So that's why I don't really believe that claim about Kim not really caring. There will be some interaction and some judgments made between them. That's for sure. You know, women do that all the time. They size up each other, they judge each other, especially when it comes to being in a relationship with the same person. Reports have been swirling that Kim Kardashian is jealous of Kanye West's new wife, Bianca Sensori. I'm just rolling with it and it is what it is. There are zero signs that Kim Kardashian and Bianca Sinceri will ever get along. And reports are saying that she has been jealous of Bianca for a while and still is jealous of her. Kardashian is jealous of the Australian architect. And this all stems from how things ended with Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. Kim Kardashian and Kanye West have officially signed their divorce papers. That divorce between Kim and Kanye was far from amicable. Kanye West's public criticism of Kim Kardashian's then boyfriend, Pete Davidson, on social media coupled with accusations about her family, added fuel to the fire of the aftermath of their highly publicized breakup. Like it was nonstop. People are wondering what is he gonna post tomorrow, the next day, and shortly after their divorce was finalized. Kim Kardashian isn't holding back her emotional turmoil over ex-husband Kanye West. Surprising reports emerge of Kanye West marrying Bianca Sensori, the architect behind his Yeezy brand, in a secretive wedding ceremony. TMZ was first to report the embattled rapper has sort of tied the knot with Bianca Sensory. And this unexpected turn of events left the Kardashian family completely surprised. So different than the person that I married. This added another layer of complexity to their already messy split, you know, Kim and Kanye. And given the messy nature of Kim Kardashian's 2022 breakup with Kanye West, it's not surprising that her relationship with Bianca might also be completely strained. Wild rumors are going around that Kanye West is controlling his new wife, Bianca Sensori, with drugs. The split escalated quickly with Kanye West dishing out some serious accusations against Kim Kardashian as well as her family. On top of that, he targeted Kim's boyfriend, Pete Davidson, with intense harassment, reportedly causing him significant distress. Like Pete was literally shook. He was even afraid for his life at one point. And this situation likely contributed to the tensions between Kim Kardashian and Bianca, potentially even before Bianca's marriage to Kanye West. Because even before Kanye West started dating Bianca, he dated actress Julia Fox. And even Julia Fox has revealed in her memoir that before her and Kanye West broke up, Kim had a serious conversation with him privately. And after that, Kanye West started acting kind of differently towards Julia. So, you know, what I think is that there is some pettiness on the part of both Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. And they made a bit of a fuss when they started dating other people, when they were in the middle of their whole divorce drama. Kim didn't really talk about it publicly, but I'm sure behind closed doors, she was like, no, 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 don't be dating her. Like, don't do that, stay away from her. But of course, Kanye was a little bit more public in his criticism of Pete Davidson, who Kim Kardashian was dating. But with all of that said, despite Kanye West clearly not approving of Kim Kardashian's relationship with Pete Davidson, he personally moved on and was seen with several women resembling Kim Kardashian, with of course Julia Fox being one of those women before he even married Bianca. Reports of this marriage shocked fans, but Kim Kardashian, it said that she might not have actually been as surprised as people thought. I feel free in the sense that I am not anybody else. An insider did share that Kim had long sensed a connection between Bianca and Kanye. And the source alleged that Kim actually harbored negative feelings due to jealousy over Bianca's looks. This is even before they were married. Because remember, Bianca was hired by Kanye West at least a year before Kim Kardashian 
filed for divorce from him. So she most likely would have either seen her in person or at least known about her, maybe saw some of her interactions with Kanye West, even though they may not have necessarily been serious about what was going on between them, but Kim may have noticed something between Bianca and Kanye during that time. One source did chime in about this and this is what they said about Kim. Kim hates her. She's pretty and Kim hates pretty girls. As mentioned before, also in previous reports, the situation became even more complicated when Bianca Sensori started bonding with Kim and Kanye's daughter, Northwest. And also an insider revealed that Kim got worried about Bianca becoming too attached to her daughter and there were concerns that Kim felt really jealous as she observed their developing relationship. So Kim was jealous of Bianca's looks, she was jealous of Bianca getting with her ex-husband so quickly, as well as jealous of Bianca bonding with her children. Contrary to these reports though, there was a source from Us Weekly that claimed that Kim wasn't actually jealous as portrayed in the media and she supposedly was supportive of Bianca and Kanye West's marriage. The two did have a ceremony and while the marriage is real to Kanye and Bianca, Kim isn't paying attention to it. However, many people do still remain skeptical thinking that this is probably on the part of Kim Kardashian's team to try to cover up the reality which is that Kim in fact is jealous of Bianca for various reasons. According to the publication Closer, Kim also feels like Kanye West and Bianca's relationship is a little bit creepy because it reminds her of her past relationship with him despite feeling a little bit jealous towards Bianca. And this is what was reported by Closer. Kim is watching the situation with Kanye and Bianca open mouthed and she can't believe how reminiscent it is of how Kanye was with her. Her. She says she can see Bianca being molded into Kanye's ideal of the perfect woman. She thinks it's worrying that Kanye did not learn his lesson and that he feels it's okay to treat people like this. It's no secret anymore that Kim Kardashian can't stand Kanye West's new wife, Bianca Sensori. Did Kim Kardashian leave a terrifying message for Bianca Sensori? Fans once again claim that Kim Kardashian was actually throwing shade and making fun of Kanye West's new wife, Bianca Sensori. So this is what Kim Kardashian ended up doing. She was showing her playful side in a new TikTok video, and this is all going on while Kanye West's new wife, Bianca, face a tough time over in Italy. Kanye wife might get arrested. Calls are being raised for Italian law enforcement to take action against Bianca Sensori. Now critics in Italy, what they've been doing is they've been really hating what Bianca has been wearing in public and are actually calling for her to be fined and even arrested. Kanye West's new wife, following her recent attention grabbing appearances in the traditionally conservative Catholic nation. And in the midst of all of that, Kanye West's former wife, Kim Kardashian, shared a video on TikTok where she danced and had fun with her daughter and a couple of other friends while they were in Tokyo, Japan. And things get really interesting. There's some pretty interesting parallels. In the video, Kim can be seen happily dancing down a quiet street while wearing dark colored clothes. And she danced to a remix version of the song American Boy by Estelle. Take me on a trip, I'd like to go someday. Now, Kim wore a cropped shirt along with an oversized black pants and sneakers, but what really got people talking was her and Kanye West's daughter, North, who wore a very similar top to one that Kanye West is known for wearing, along with the chain around the neck. Yeah. So clearly this is a reference to Kanye West. And again, this is all happening shortly after Bianca Sensori faced criticism in Italy for wearing daring and revealing outfits as they toured the country in public. According to the prominent tourism platform CIU Travel, locals view it as offensive to witness visitors strolling the streets in various degrees of undress. Now, another parallel is that prior to being in Italy, Bianca and Kanye West were also in Tokyo, Japan, where they also made headlines for their fashion choices that they made in public. Kanye West's daughter, North, also met up with them in Tokyo for a time before heading back home to her mother, Kim, in California. So yeah, we have Kim, she's happily dancing in the streets along with North, fully covered, and fans point this out as it being a dig towards Kanye and Bianca. Everyone has their own truth of how they think something happened. 
almost like Kim is saying, this is how you do it in public, Bianca. Now, according to an insider, they said this, Kim is actually glad that Kanye has found someone that makes him so happy. She knows that they both completely moved on from their relationship and she wants nothing but the best for him. Yet some fans find this pretty hard to believe due to some questionable and shady jabs that Kim has repeatedly made towards Kanye and Bianca. Kind of like subliminal messages, sometimes a little cryptic. Bianca's in story knows how to make an appearance with her questionable fashion sense. This will never not be shocking to me. I honestly can't believe it every time I see it. This is wild. She missed her stepdaughter Northwest big stage debut. And when she was seen again, this is the outfit she stepped out in. Pretty much no article of clothing was in sight. I guess her clothes were on vacation. Bianca Sensori is yet again leaving nothing to the imagination with her latest style stunt. Now, we're gonna get into this. The details get more crazy as we go on. So Bianca was driving her car with Kanye West in the passenger seat, and not only was she missing pants, she was also pretty much only wearing underclothing on the top. I just can't believe it. I said it out loud to my coworkers at FTD News, this will never not be surprising to me. Meanwhile, Kanye was beside her wearing a big white hoodie and covering his face with his phone. I honestly at this point think that it's Bianca's choice to do this. I think she just enjoys it. I don't personally believe it's Kanye controlling her. He's probably just supporting her. You need to appreciate every moment. That's just my opinion though. Could be wrong. I asked my coworker Yusuf Awadala what he thought about this. He responded saying, I think do what you want with how you dress, just not in public. I don't think Kanye has influence on how Bianca dresses. I think it's Bianca mostly doing it for attention. I think Bianca and Kanye are a good match because they are both definitely insane. They might stand the test of time and last forever as a couple. I agree with Yusuf when he says you should be mindful of how you dress in public. I mean, there's kids out there who could be seeing this, be influenced by it. To me, it just seems wrong. I like saying shit that sounds wrong anyway because you know wrong is okay i think in a business sense kanye and bianca they know what they're doing but this missing clothing thing it's not it northwest was cast in a live rendition of the lion king at the hollywood bowl she got to play simba she had a lot of support there including kanye chris jenner courtney travis they filmed her as she was on stage but bianca was nowhere to be seen When the performance was done, she got a standing ovation. Kim shared a sweet photo of the backstage passes she got on Instagram. But could this be because Bianca's been upset about Kanye's recent business venture that reportedly is not suitable for all audiences? We have to be really careful on how to word things due to the risk of getting flagged, but if you're curious, you can Google it. We're gonna get more into the juicy details. Kanye was gonna start a new business venture that Bianca was apparently super peeved about. I can't say what type of business, but let's just say she definitely has a reason to be upset. A source claimed that Bianca was freaking out and that it may be the last straw to her marriage. Apparently, she's also been spending a lot more time with her parents, who also seem very concerned about her. Her outfits are outlandish and confounding, and people can't seem to stop talking about them. She's had quite a bit of copycats, including Kim. Bianca Sensori looked extremely nervous while out and about clutching her favorite accessory. We get too caught up in the past and what everyone's saying and what everyone's tweeting. A white pillow to match the bodysuit she was wearing. In exclusive photos captured by the US Sun, Bianca and Kanye were spotted enjoying a sunny day out in Italy. So Kanye and Bianca were just photographed arriving at the airport in Florence, rocking their usual unique styles. I think that there's people who are wired by their parents. Bianca definitely turned heads in a long-sleeved, tight bodysuit. She paired it with black thigh-high boots, which totally pulled the look together. Although, fans noticed that she looked extremely nervous as she clutched onto Kanye and her pillow for comfort. She put her brunette hair back into a slick bun. Guys, this is crazy. We're gonna get into it. Another time while the couple was in Italy, Bianca was caught walking around in a beige sheer bodysuit with a velvet purple pillow clung to her chest. Sensori was spotted covering her ensemble with a hotel pillow. If you guys have been following the other videos about Bianca, you'll know that she's known for making extreme statements in the name of fashion and shock value. Leroy Kenton, who is a Kanye and Bianca expert and also founder of FTD News, spoke up about this bizarre wardrobe choice. He was quoted saying, we've seen Bianca rock this look before and she looked just as nervous Nervous the first time she rocked the look. She was probably holding that pillow for hours and her hands were probably really tired. So maybe she was scared
scared to let go of the pillow because Kanye would get upset with her. What I love telling people is like, who do you know? Is this the direction that fashion is going? Are we going to see more people, especially women, holding up their clothing? Guys, this is ridiculous. I don't understand the point of this. Maybe it's a strategy to get people talking. If it is, it's working. The next outfit is also insane. Just days before their Italy adventure, our favorite lovebirds were caught by paparazzi in LA. Bianca was behind the wheel of her silver Porsche, while Kanye was lounging in the passenger seat, completely entranced by his phone. Ye was rocking another white outfit, just like the one he wore in Italy, and Bianca, on the other hand, was turning heads in a beige bodysuit that didn't leave much to the imagination. Apparently, Bianca's family is worried about her. One expert has said they could stage an intervention to address her unhealthy behavior. Since marrying the controversial rapper, Bianca has undergone a complete transformation in her looks, behavior, and mannerisms. An insider reported that Bianca's father is worried that his son-in-law is turning his daughter into a trashy-looking, marketable commodity. Bianca Sensori's dad reportedly thinks Kanye West is turning his daughter into a trash commodity. Some insiders have claimed that Bianca's father is keen on confronting Kanye about all of this. Other reports suggested that Bianca's family is hurting, watching their loved one being paraded around like a trophy pony. Kanye has also been accused of shutting her out from her family in Australia. The thing is guys, she's a grown woman who can make her own decisions. I'm sure if she was like severely unhappy, she would leave, especially since it seems like she has a supportive family who would help her. One opinion I recently heard is that the entire thing is Bianca's decision and Kanye is just supporting her. According to his Instagram though, like clearly he loves it. He's a huge fan of posting Bianca in very shocking outfits. Out of all of her edgy, shocking, and bizarre looks, which one struck out to you most? What do you think of the new white pillow outfit? Stay tuned for why we think Doja Cat is copying Bianca Sensori. In 2018, Doja rose to fame with the release of the music video for her single, Moo. Moo. The 28-year-old has since released albums that have sold platinum and won three video music awards in addition to a Grammy. After her appearance at the Met Gala, she just headlined Coachella and turned heads. But some reportedly claims to have witnessed her revealing deed on Bianca Sensori, another contentious celebrity. Wearing a sheer crop top and tights, Doja let her innermost thoughts out as she made her way to the Met Gala after party. She wore a beige undergarment under the tights and showed herself above the waist in the monogram grand top. Bianca is one person who has plenty of experience going almost entirely bare. The wife of Kanye West has gained notoriety for donning similarly skimpy attire. Last month at Disneyland, the Yeezy architectural designer showed off a spandex bodysuit. She stunned fans a few days prior by dining with the rapper while wearing an incredibly transparent outfit. Fans now claim that Doja is gradually becoming more like Bianca. On X, the platform that was formerly known as Twitter, someone said Doja Cat is slowly replacing Kanye West's wife. Another joker said, or she's secretly Kanye West's next wife. She came into the limelight and sold her soul almost immediately, always doing weird stuff, a third person wrote. Yeah, and then it just turned into this. Doja arrived at the gala earlier in the evening wearing a drenched white smock. Many compared the transparent gown, which adhered tightly to her body like a damp plastic bag. Even Doja's other musicians were taken aback by her appearance. Singer Camille Cabello commented, the girls are wet tonight. Upon spotting Doja. Once more, X fans snarked away. One individual jokes, Doja Cat took the do you ever feel like a plastic bag lyrics too literally, alluding to a line from Katy Perry's song Firework. Do you ever feel like a plastic bag? Somebody check on Doja Cat, another begged, before speculating, next up, aluminum foil? Doja appeared as though she had just woken up from a cat nap while she was shopping in New York right before the gala, wearing an outfit that was essentially a bed sheet. The singer uploaded a video of herself trying on some possible new jewelry at a jewelry counter. She was holding up the enormous white sheet with her arms folded about her. During a scene in the video, Doja unintentionally let her white outfit fall down, exposing her bottom and the under garment she was wearing below, but the garment revealed her entire tattooed back, making her look topless. A New York stylist claimed in February that Doja usually keeps her fans guessing by exposing a lot of skin. Amanda Sanders said to the US Sun, Doja does not have a signature style and her looks are not about good fashion. This means there is no continuity of her showcasing her assets. It is different each time. Even her hair is different each time she appears. She continued, her outfits are about Doja's interpretation.
interpretation of fashion. It is all orchestrated so that people carry on guessing who she is. What do you guys think? Is she really copying Bianca? Bianca Sensori's mom is being called out for her hypocrisy because she criticized Bianca's fashion in the past, but now she's dressing more like Bianca. Then it's scary. Alexandra Sensori, the mother of Bianca Sensori, flaunted her form in a skin-tight black dress after criticizing her daughter's style, like I was saying. And Bianca's sister, Angelica, shared the picture of Alexandra, their mom, on Instagram. It looked like Alexandra was trying on this black gown in a changing room somewhere, and the dress had a plunging halter neckline. And in honor of Mother's Day, the caption mummy was used by Angelica in the photo. Not like an Egyptian mummy though, but that's how Brits and Aussies say mommy. They use a U. Interesting. You need to appreciate every moment. A lot of people don't appreciate their moment. Now, according to reports, Bianca Sensori's family was pretty upset with her style and fashion that she was displaying publicly to the whole world. And of course, I guess that's expected when you're married to Kanye West. And this is where the hypocrisy comes in, because get this, Alexandra visited Bianca and Kanye back in March of 2024 to have a sit down talk about what he's doing with her daughter, Bianca, and the outfits that he allegedly is forcing her to wear. Bianca Sensori's mother proving the media wrong. Bianca and her mom were seen in public a couple times after that and Bianca didn't really tone down her dressing style while she was with her mom. Well, she did a little bit, but not really, and this led many fans to believe that whatever was said caused Bianca's mom to accept Bianca's fashion. Bianca's dad, on the other hand, also wanted to have a sit down with Kanye West, but apparently Kanye has avoided him altogether. We've come to a compromise, but I'm not finished because I don't compromise. And that meeting never happened, although the meeting with her mom happened. And according to a source who spoke to the Daily Mail, this is what happened. Bianca's father was not necessarily pleased with his wife's visit to see their daughter because he feels like she enabled Bianca to continue doing what she's doing. Bianca's father, whose name is Leo, is said to still have big issues with this and wishes to intervene to stop this behavior from his daughter. The source for the Daily Mail has stated that Bianca did cover up a bit more for her family, but it's clear from all the recent public appearances that she has no intention of stopping the style of fashion that she's wearing out in public for everybody to see everything that she has. Kanye West himself even joked about this and he actually appeared on a podcast explaining why he encourages Bianca to dress the way she does. Kanye was a guest on the Download podcast back in April of 2024 and Kanye said this to host Jalal Alkali. My blank is the most influential blank on the planet. And then the host responded by saying that Bianca is the best dressed. And Kanye, he replied by stating she is the best undressed. So now with Bianca's association with Kanye West, she was an instant celebrity. And she's also become a fashion icon. She's more in the public eye. And her mom and even her sisters have been trying to dress like her a little bit more often. And I don't think this is a coincidence. I think that they're really just trying to get in on some of the action. I think that this will continue. This trend will keep on going. Bianca has very fashionable sisters, as well as a very fashionable mother who lives a relatively lavish lifestyle. Not necessarily lavish like the Kardashian type of lavish, but they do pretty well for themselves. And the fact that Bianca has been getting a lot more praise for her fashion and has caused even very high profile celebrities to copy her style, I think now Bianca's mom wants to get, like I mentioned, in on that action a little bit. Especially now that Bianca has a proof of concept that her fashion, if given some time, will be more accepted in the public. Like it didn't backfire at all. It didn't hurt Bianca's career in any way. As a matter of fact, it just made her more famous and it made her more money. And it just, all around, it was just a plus for Bianca. The positives outweigh the negatives here. So her family is seeing this and saying, hmm, maybe there's something here. 
With that said though, some fans have literally been begging Bianca to leave Kanye West because they feel like he's just using her to get back at his ex-wife Kim Kardashian and that he actually doesn't really love Bianca. I don't really know about that. I think there is some love here, but the dynamic in this relationship is just different with the dynamic that he had with Kim. Like he wanted to start a family with Kim and they knew each other for a lot longer than he knew Bianca. It's just a completely different dynamic. Maybe in the beginning, he was trying to get back a little bit on Kim, but I think right now him and Bianca are in a pretty good groove and it's interesting to see how their relationship unfolds publicly. So my prediction is just like I predicted months ago that she'll influence the fashion world and that there's gonna be a lot of copycats. I said this, I predict now that we'll be seeing a lot more headlines of Bianca's mom and Bianca's sisters dressing like her. Bianca Sensori is caught yet again wearing an absolutely insanely daring outfit. She was spotted braless in a see-through bodysuit while pulling up to a luxury LA hotel. <laughs> her husband, Kanye West, was also in attendance and fully clothed as Bianca chose the opposite, as usual. Bianca and Kanye met with rapper Ty Dolla Sign for late night drinks at the Chateau Marmont in Los Angeles. Bianca chose to skip wearing anything under it as she donned a see-through bodysuit with crystals embellished throughout the clothing item. This is rough, this is rough. <laughs> Show everybody. While Bianca opted for a nude look, Kanye chose to wear a classic all-black outfit. Kanye was spotted in a leather jacket with an attached hoodie, black trousers, and black sunglasses. Over the years, Bianca has been notorious for stepping out in barely their clothing. While she often covers herself with some fabric, Bianca has been sporting the see-through look as of late. Another time, Bianca wore a sheer top and micro shorts as she and Kanye attended the movies. Shockingly, the Australian model was still seen putting her curves on display in nude boy shorts and a long-sleeved shirt. Just days before their movie date, Bianca turned heads as she stepped out in a see-through top with her chest on full display as she left West Hollywood tanning salon. Critics are always pondering whether Bianca's style has broken any laws of indecent exposure. Following her tanning day, attorney Nima Romani previously told the US Sun that Bianca wouldn't be penalized for her outfits or lack of outfits. Under California law, indecent exposure is a misdemeanor punishable by up to six months in jail, Nima revealed. From a legal perspective, it was a mistake. If there is a prior conviction, it can be prosecuted as a felony, but in California, exposing one's chest is generally not indecent exposure. This is to protect women who are chest feeding or exposing their chest for specific reasons. The same applies to exposing one's underwear like Bianca has been doing, the attorney said. Nima went on to say it would be unlikely that Bianca would have a run-in with the law due to her recent outings. Though critics have continuously commented on Bianca's looks, Kanye revealed he enjoys seeing his wife in little to no clothing. You need to appreciate every moment. A lot of people don't appreciate their moment. In an interview with the Download podcast in April, Kanye spoke with host Jalal Akali on the matter. My bee is the most influential bee on the planet, my wife, Kanye said about Bianca. Jalal proceeded to call Bianca the best dressed when Kanye cut him off to say Bianca was actually the best undressed. Every woman you get with is the best dressed and undressed at that time, Jalal commented, referring to his exes Kim Kardashian and Julia Fox. I cannot deny, Kanye replied while laughing with the host. As controversy about Kanye West and Bianca Sensori simmered about the alleged control, a source close to Kim Kardashian spoke out on the matter. Expressing seemingly her views to Closer Magazine, the insider said that the Kardashian star genuinely pities Bianca. She knows firsthand how controlling Kanye is and how difficult it is to get away from him once he has you hooked. Bianca stepped out in the most daring outfit ever. She just keeps pushing the limits to see how far she can go. Let's dive in and talk about this new outfit. Thank you. Kanye West's wife Bianca Sensori left little to the imagination while on a solo shopping trip. She stayed true to her signature barely there style in a nude tube dress that appeared to be made out of stocking material. The sheer material allowed her skin colored garments and often exposed backside to shine through. She did not appear to be wearing a bra though photographers did not capture her fully from the front. She completed her edgy look with black pumps and fastened her short brunette hair with a butterfly clip. Bianca wore the eye-catching outfit just days after she switched up her style by covering her body in a cream-colored turtleneck dress as she ran errands with two of her stepchildren. Kanye joined along for the family outing and kept a low profile in a white hoodie and off-white trousers. Kanye was spotted spending quality time with North, Saint, and Chicago at Disneyland before meeting up with his wife to run errands. New feed, 
the good life. Let's go on a living spree. Shit. It's unusual for Kanye to appear in public without Bianca. They've been virtually inseparable since they got married in December 2022. I have to say, Kanye and Bianca, although I don't agree with what they do, they're kind of a cute couple. They're side by side 24 seven. She loves his kids. They don't seem to argue. They seem to get along. Seems like an overall great marriage, despite what she chooses to wear in public. And while Bianca's risque style has reportedly caused some concern from her family and friends that she has lost a sense of self, a source told Page Six that she's simply putting on a show while out with her husband in public. <laughs> People are confusing Bianca's creativity, the insider said. She's a phenomenal personality, a phenomenal actor who can entertain in the public. I get your number. Oh, huh? yeah. She's a performance artist. Bianca is as much a performer as Ye is. Another person close to Bianca said that she knows she's working when she's spending time with Kanye and acted like her old self during a trip back to her old country of Australia. It was very obvious to us that she was acting like she was off the clock from a job, the friend noted. They added, when you look at all the press, you'd believe that she's lost her mind, so it was good to see her with her family and being the person we remembered. The clothes were back to normal, there was nothing to suggest her time with Kanye had a lasting effect. This makes the most sense. They get a ton of attention from what they do, so obviously they're going to keep doing what works. If you guys have been following Kanye and Bianca, you'll know that this recent outfit is a no surprise at all. All they do is parade Bianca around in crazy outfits that make no sense. Just keeps going, it just keeps going, and it's going to get more extreme. 